here is the Black Beast, Derek Lewis. It wasn't all that long ago that he beat Alexander Volkov, had won 9 of 10, and earned a title shot against you in New York City. Derek Lewis back on the ground here tonight. Derek Lewis is a beast and one of the strongest guys that I have ever felt inside of the octagon. Every time his punches land, you can feel this unbelievable thud up against your head and the body. And everything he does, it is just absolute power. He's a very, very good athlete, as he shows with these double kicks that he always likes to throw up. Derek Lewis, when you win nine out of 10 fights, you're a monster. And he is on paper one of the more prolific knockout artists this division historically has ever seen. The Black Beast, ready to get back to it here tonight. inside the octagon to Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. <laughs> And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, Jake the Health Kick Kid Matthews. So Herb Dean, third man Ready, in there fight. for this one. Ready. All right, so as we get this stand-up only fight underway, just a quick reminder on the rule set, no grappling or wrestling of any type. And fighters also cannot follow us with ground strikes on the canvas. So if you knock your opponent down, you cannot follow up with strikes. Very important to point that out here at the beginning of round one. Oh, beautiful jab by him there, really taking advantage of what is an obvious edge and reach. Well, he's the taller fighter and able to land a knee to the body with relative ease there. All right, so a big early land by the boxer. He put a lot of steam on that one as he's able to get that hook home, DC. He lands it perfect. I mean, he throws it perfect. Right hand is always where it needs to be. If he throws it with the right, the left hand's always where it needs to be. It's tight, it's crisp, and it lands with a lot of power. Oh, that jab alerted his opponents. Missed on the right hand. Nice crack there. So just over 20 total strikes have landed for Derek Lewis. Oh, and yet another knee finds the target. So a huge moment here. Now we'll see if he can follow it up. Well, now you see some visible damage on the side underneath the elbow. He told us he was going to invest in the body, and he hasn't missed a whole lot tonight. You didn't expect him to do it this effectively. He's done a fantastic job of following the game. Oh, knee strike right to the bottom. Right. 
right hook attempt. That's a miss. He landed it perfectly. Perfect placement. Perfect position. What a huge blow in a big moment in this fight. Watch for him to set up that hook again now. Gotta start looking for the finish here. Just out of range with the big right hand. Body shot now, but it's turned back by Matthews. Well, he's been good tonight, but he missed with that one. There, if you are teaching an up and coming fighter about throwing the oh! oh, he lands a massive kick here. Oh. oh, saved by the bell. That's the end of the round, and thankfully for him, it came at the right time. He got knocked down just before the horn. We'll see if his corner can keep him in the fight. Just 60 seconds with which to recover here before the next round. All right, let's check out some of the action, DC, and how about the punching acumen by that fighter in that previous round? He does not waste anything. He does not loop punches. Everything's tight. Everything's precise. He's a sniper. We always talk about how he's a sniper. He is a sniper, and it showed in that exchange that allowed him to drop his opponent. You ready? You ready? All right, round two. And there's that jab. I'm not sure his opponent knows where he is. No, he doesn't know where he is. He's hurt real bad. That punch landed in the perfect spot. Well, I'm no fighter, but if I rock a guy to that extent, I feel like I'm closing the show. Absolutely. Oh, yeah, oh, my goodness. Big left hand. Oh, nice right hand. Oh, how good is that jab by Matthews? Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Oh, beautiful. Back and forth we go. Matthews' his nose is bleeding now, so we'll see how he handles that adversity, but nothing ideal about it here in the middle of this fight. Just over three minutes to go. Ooh, what a punch. Oh, the Black Beast strikes again! Oh my goodness, what a fight. Bruce Buffer has your decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean's called a stop to this contest at one minute, 56 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout, Derek the Black Beast Lewis. Well, Derek Lewis just might be the UFC heavyweight champion of the world before this run is said and done. Congratulations to the Black Beast on yet another UFC triumph here tonight. Really starting to put all of his skills together. That is a scary proposition for his fellow heavyweight contenders tonight.